Hey guys, thank you so much for taking time to come over and join us over on Rochester Seat and Air. I'm Fritz Rochester, and guys, um, <clears throat> I'm by no means a, a tech geek here, but uh, what I've done here is I've got me a Nexus 7, and I'm going to be utilizing this Nexus 7 second generation 2013, as I believe is what it is. And you can tell it's the second generation from the camera, from I don't know if you can see the camera lens right there over to the right, and it actually has a back facing camera as well, along with uh, two uh, uh, speakers. But uh, it seems to be a pretty good little device there, guys. But I want to be able to protect it. You know, I don't, I don't want to get, I'm going to be utilizing this out in the field. This ain't going to be for, you know, I mean, I'll have fun with it, but it's actually going to help me in my line of work. And uh, basically, what I've done, guys, is I went out and I got me some of these. Uh, well, actually, I had my good buddy Ray mail them to me. Uh, these are Tech Armor screen protectors. And as you can see right here, this one here is actually for um, uh, the Nexus 7 uh, HD Clear. So what I'm actually going to do, guys, is uh, I'm going to actually put these on, or I'm going to try to. Uh, they look like they might be a little bit of a pain, but uh, I was going to take you all along for the ride. All right, guys. All right, guys. We've done worked out the installation instructions. Uh, watch the installation video, okay? Wash and dry your hands. Remove the dirt and oils. Uh, clean your screen. Use with the provided lint-free. I went ahead and I dusted it off with my microfiber towel here, but we'll go ahead and uh, follow. The, go by the book here. It's pretty clean. I just unboxed it. Okay, looking good in the neighborhood. Okay. Number four, peel back for protective film. Number one, find the green sticker labeled number one. Peel back one inch to expose the adhesive side of the screen protector. Do not touch adhesive side. Okay, that's easier said than done. Uh, line up the edge or long edge of the screen protector with your device and begin to apply the adhesive side of the screen protective protector. This step is critical to be as precise as possible. Okay, well I'll give it my best shot here. <laughs> I'm sure it's going to be wonderful. Alright, so it's peel back about an inch or two. Alright, I don't know how I'm supposed to do that without touching it. Okay. Alright, let's line this dude up. Easier said than done. Okay. All right. All right. Smooth cool. out the bubbles. All right, let's smooth out the bubbles. Guys. Peel back protective film number two. Find the red sticker label, slowly peel back, and final protective film to expose your screen protector. Use your free hand to hold down the screen protector below while removing the protective film. Final polish, use the included lint free polish cloth to yada yada yada. Alright. Okay, now we have a ton of bubbles. All right, guys, let me uh, get after this, see if I can straighten this out. All right, guys, I think I got it. Now let's just polish it up again. Now we got our new armor on there. Rock and roll. All let's see what it looks like here.
good, guys. All right, guys, we're traveling in the winter wonderland here. It's like eight degrees here. We're expecting more snow tonight and lows of like zero. But uh, anyway, y'all. Let me, uh, okay, guys, um, I'm pretty happy with the subcase. I've been packing it around for the last few days. Wanted to see how she was going to work out for me. And basically, it's going to be another added uh, added uh, piece of protection to our arsenal for our Nexus 7 second gen uh, 2013 model here, along with that uh, that uh, tech armor, or armor tech, or whatever you call it, those shields that we actually put on the Nexus uh, face itself. Uh, those seem to be working out really great, too. Um, basically, guys, I mean, it's just a, a really nice uh, cover. Um, right here on the back we have the, uh, the hole for the, uh, the back facing camera. We've got the two holes here for the uh, speakers. And believe it or not guys, these speakers on here really work. They jam. Um, let's see, we have uh, the opening for our rockers here, our on and off switch and our uh, volume control. And we have the opening for our charging, charging port here. Um, what I really love about this unit guys is basically it turns it on and off without you actually having to hit that rocker. Look at that. And when you're using it like in this mode, you can actually put it on. It's got like a little handle back here. You can actually put it on like a catcher's mitt and you ain't going to drop it. That's pretty cool. I thought that feature was neat. All right, guys. The real reason I bought this puppy. Let's take a peek. What pow. There we go. We got the I manifold app on there. And we got the I manifold coming to us here shortly. We're going to do a little testing with it. And I'm hoping y'all are going to come back and, uh, and uh, check it out. And uh, we're going to go over it thoroughly. All right, guys. I appreciate y'all watching. And we'll holler at you soon. Take care. All right, guys. I wanted to share one more feature about the subcase case for the Nexus 7. I think it's a wicked feature. You can actually make a stand out of it. You're looking at it right there, guys. I think that is cool. And basically, all you do is just take the, take the case here, fold it in on itself, insert it right underneath that tab, and you're ready to rock, guys. It feels like it's uh, pretty daggone stable so, uh, and sturdy. So uh, basically, guys, that's uh, what I wanted to share with you about that. And I'm thinking all in all, uh, the subcase... Along with the Tech Armor screen protector, I think we should have some adequate protection for our Nexus tablet here. Um, I'm sure there's a lot better stuff on the market, but uh, this is all I can afford right now. I mean, I'm sure they make stuff that, you know, is submergible, but uh, I don't plan on staying out in a thunderstorm, uh, you know, checking the unit or nothing. But, uh, <laughs> but anyway, guys, just wanted to share that with you. Um, I'm actually going to be able also to, uh, I've, I've, uh, over my time in the HVAC industry, I've compiled a, a pretty good library of uh, HVAC PDFs, and uh, and I'm actually going to be able to download those to a thumb drive and actually take them out in the field with me, whether or not I have an internet or uh, connection or not, and be able to utilize those if I need them, which I think is too cool. But uh, guys, while I got you, I just wanted to show you this feature, which I think we could actually utilize out in the field as well. I think this is too cool. Okay, Google, what is 78 ounces to pounds? 78 ounces is 4.88 pounds. Ain't that something, guys? There we go. We can weigh our refrigerant in just from her telling us. Ain't that something? I think that's the cat's pajamas. But uh, anyway, guys, what I love about this feature is right now that we're in this setting, uh, all I have to do is give her a command, and this is how you do it. Okay, Google, what is HVAC? HVAC, HVAC. HVAC is the technology of indoor and vehicular environmental comfort. HVAC system design is a subdiscipline of mechanical engineering based on the principles of thermodynamics, fluid mechanics, and heat transfer. All right, guys, is that not something or else, man? I'm, I'm telling you. Um, man, I appreciate y'all watching my videos. I can't tell you that enough. Uh, I appreciate all the positive feedback, and I appreciate the fellowship. Um, there's more to come on this, guys. Trust me, I'm gonna, we're going to have a real good time with this one. Uh, all this wireless technology that's coming into play is just going to be awesome, and it's going to be an asset to our trade and industry. Um, all right, guys. Well, I'm getting a little hungry, so uh, I reckon. Okay, Google, wh where is the closest McDonald's? Here are the listings for McDonald's within 20 miles. All right, guys. I'm going to go get something to eat. I reckon I'll holler at y'all soon. Thanks so much for watching. Take care. Mm -hmm.